He said, Sean, why were you born? And I was like, because my mom and dad did it. <laughs> Have you ever said something stupid and then the person you say it to acts like it never even happened? And they ask you the question again. He said, why were you born? Good morning, everybody. This is Sean Stevenson. Last month, I lost a friend. He was this incredible man. But he was born with a genetic condition that prevented him from living a normal life. It was called osteogenesis imperfecta, or brittle bone disease. When I was born, the doctors told my parents that I would be dead within the first 24 hours of my life. 35 years later, all those doctors are dead. Sean was special. Throughout his entire life, Sean Stevenson was unapologetically himself. I can tell you I'm only an expert on one thing, and that's how to be me. And I do it well. Sean didn't get the same advantages in life that all of us did, but he never, ever allowed the cards he was dealt to slow him down. Sean passed away last month at the age of 40. Now, all of his friends discovered something magical about Sean after he passed away. All across the web, hundreds of people started sharing beautiful notes of appreciation and gratitude that Sean wrote to them over the last couple of months. I got this video from Sean 10 days before he died. Vision, how are you, brother? I just was thinking about you today and I send you a quick little video and thank you. Uh, you probably don't remember this conversation in Kuala Lumpur and you turned to me and you said something that... He acknowledged me for something I said to him seven years ago. How did he even remember that? I care about you. I, I, I think about you. I see your progress with Mind Valley. But I just, I adore you. I'm so proud of you and happy for you. That was to Sean Stevenson, we all knew. If somebody pities me, they're wasting their time. Because I have chosen a life of strength. You are not your condition. You are not. I am not disabled. Sure, I'll take the handicapped parking privileges. <laughs> but that does not define me as a man. I'll tell you why I was born. And I hope it inspires you to find out why you were born. I was born to rid this world of insecurity. Because when a human being is insecure, they do stupid stuff. He never allowed his pain to prevent him from giving love to other people. You are enough. I'll tell you, I made a pledge as a therapist to love all human beings no matter what they've done. Because deep down inside, i found that every human being just wants to be loved. This is a dedication to the strongest man I've ever met. If this video touched you in some way, consider making a small donation to Sean's family. Sean lost his life last month when the wheelchair he was in overturned, causing him to injure his skull. Doctors couldn't help, and um, he died on the operating table. If there's any way you can donate and help, this would mean a lot to Sean. And please, share Sean's spirit, soul, and message with the world.